Hello, lovely primary three pupils of Touch Paris Academy. Good day. How are you all doing? I hope you enjoyed the holiday. I know we've missed class activities. We pray that the pandemic will soon be over so that we can all return to school and meet physically. All right? Yes. I want to urge you all that you take this online class very seriously, even as we begin this exciting third term. We are beginning a new topic in home economics, and our first topic is sewing basic stitches. Now, what is stitch? Stitch is the movement of thread and needle into and out of a cloth in order to secure two pieces of fabrics together okay for example the clothes that we wear is as a result of stitches okay the movement of the thread and the needle in and out of clothes to secure together those materials to come out well all right next slide we have two kinds of stitches and they are temporary stitches and the permanent stitches okay the temporary they are made you use your needles to achieve that okay your needles or your pin to achieve that and it's for a short while okay then for your permanent stitches they are a lot stronger than the temporary stitches okay good next slide temporary stitches okay as i said earlier they are used to hold two or more pieces of fabrics together until permanent stitches are applied okay they are handmade all right it is made and used for just a short period depending on when you want to sew permanently, okay, so that you can see what you're doing. You could use your needles to hold or your pin to hold for a short period, okay, so you can bring out the beauty of the dress you're making before you use your sewing machines, okay, on them permanently. Next slide permanent stitches permanent stitches are stitches left on the garment okay and which forms a part of the stitched garment they are stronger than the temporary stitches all right they are usually made firm and they are used as long as possible until you get tired of that material and examples of the permanent stitches are the running stitches you have the machine stitches you have so many of the permanent stitches okay good now we have come to the end of today's class and by god's grace in our next class we'll be discussing examples of temporary and permanent stitches an assignment has been dropped for you in the PDF file. Please ensure you do the assignment and submit. Ensure you stay home, wash your hands regularly, and stay safe. Don't forget, I love you all. Bye.